Hello and welcome. This is going to be a video having to do with Yoshimitsu's guard break setup. Now, now the video in question was basically asked for. How exactly do you perform a guard break setup near the wall? Now, the way it's done, it's quite simple actually, and the more that you do it, the more that you'll be able to perform it in an actual game. It's simply this way. The moment that you're in your no sword stance and you go and do whatever against the opponent, as long as they're in a wall splat state. As long as you hit them before they manage to completely slide all the way down to the ground, you can then perform Kencho into 2 into the fully charged 1 plus 2. It's pretty easy. If you want an indicator as to exactly when to actually use your Kencho 2 against the opponent once they're slumping back down to the ground, you can essentially use the moment where their butts are about to then hit the ground. That's when you should be using Kencho 2 against them into the fully charged 1 plus 2. If you don't manage to do it correctly then, then the opponent would immediately side Okeme and then you will be exposed to what they may do right afterwards against you. And that's essentially it. It's not really anything requiring a whole lot of execution, it's just basically timing. Once you get the timing down, you can essentially just put the Kencho into 2, right as their butts are about to slump down to the ground, hit them with the 2, go for the fully charged 1 plus 2, and that's it. They can't do anything. The one caveat is that if the opponent decides to stay grounded, they can't decide to go for a toe kick of some kind to hit you right out of the Kencho 2 1 plus 2 stance. And they can also hit you out of the stance by simply doing the spring kick against you. And even a mid kick on wake up can also hit you out of the fully charged 1 plus 2. But on the case of a regular 1 plus 2, it will still hit them. And that's all. As long as you perform it exactly how I've mentioned, you don't have to worry about whipping the actual Kencho 2 into the 1 plus 2. In fact, if they do side Okame immediately and they attempt to attack you right afterwards, you can then get yourself a full launch in that course. So I hope that everything was to your liking, that the video was informative. If you liked the video, give the video a like or dislike if you want to. Subscribe to see more of my shit. If you want to become a member of my channel, you can hit the join button and you can become a member of this channel, essentially. And if not, then I do have a Patreon if you do want to help me right there as well. And yeah, stay tuned. Stay safe.